Hello there, and welcome to what very well may be the final episode of the Sweden campaign, depending on how comments go. We are poised to declare war on our long-term allies, Austria. We need Poland here in the centre, and we need Brandenburg over here as well. So, what we would like to do is mop them up, or mop as much up as we can. We are poised. We are two turns away. When this army is retrained, everyone's now standing in where they need to go. He's going to go for Ukraine. We've got a supporting army coming from Moscow. That's going to finish at the end of next turn as well. So we're about to light the touch paper on the final solution. I am always say in, Europe, in European Empire games, make sure your settings are turned up to 720. Otherwise it looks awful and there's no point watching these videos. But I have thoroughly enjoyed being the Swedish. Um... It's a little bit interesting to me ooh, that I haven't really had to... F I was really, really hoping to fight in India. India was where I wanted to be, and it didn't work out. We had a war with the Indians from memory, but didn't quite go to plan. So we're how many turns away? You already are you? next turn so you can come stand here that was stupid so it is actually going to be this army that goes forward okie doke someone's dead hang on a minute and our finances have been absolutely totaled why can we not oh, there you go there's money now you I will just let you rebel and we'll auto resolve it, that's not a problem. So next turn Do we have any trade ships? I believe we do. And you come and you can go that way. We're still building trade. We did queue an awful lot. Yeah, we'll have another end turn. And then it's onwards to Poland. We have a redonkulous amount of men. The what, two armies sitting in India that we've never been able to do anything with because of our alliances. But... You don't know which way the alliances will go, so and yeah, you're you're a bit miffed. Oh no, that was the plan. We we, we planned to let them rebel, and then we'll defeat them. Fleet arrives. What are we on? Seventeen twenty. That's the maximum you can have. You're complete. So if we just quickly go back to India, there is some more trade to be had. Move these across. Right, let's see just how much hits the fan. Right. 
Clear the leg, Ringan. Right, that's the problem. Is that actually? <laughs> Um, Navy. Who destroyed the na- oh Christ, Austria's got m most of Italy. Right, let's just run around and kill stuff. Mm -hmm. Then we shall take you and we'll go and we'll take the Ukraine. You're going to come through towards Poland. You're going to go and take Lithuania. Who are we actually at war with? We're at war with... Austria, Hessen, Venice... We're at war with Great Britain. Oh, I thought that was the British flag. Ha! Huh. And we have no money. That's going to prove problematic. But we do have a lot of fleets that can sort ourselves out with. We're still not... We're still going to go bankrupt. That's a problem. But all we've got to do is survive long enough for him to take this city here. In reality. You're going for that. You're going for that. And we need Poland. Yeah, we don't care. It's at this point that we're just ploughing on now. Do we want to fight that? Wouldn't that be exciting? Um, no, I don't care. <laughs> it's just very much... It's Brandenburg or bust. Nobody cares about that either. We are far too advanced and superior. Ah, we're making money. We have more of them. In you go, sir. Seven grand's not too bad. Right. Back to Europe and order. Lord Belagringen Borja. Can you read? Oh, poo. Hela Herren. Thought I was going to click on the wrong button, and I did. Demand surrender. We'll take the Ukraine from you as well. Era 
order. And now we can actually repair the territories with the money that we've generated from taking. Oh, no, we just don't mind that. It just doesn't affect us. Opportunity to intercept. Yes, please. need the artillery for this. Where did they... where are they? They're over here somewhere. Oh hang on, they're coming over the walls. Well, that's even easier. Let's just make sure we shoot them. Run. Ah, oh, this isn't the most organized defense you've ever seen. So just gotta go in the buildings. Chick come, friends. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, we're gonna lose my artillery. Building lost, where? This is not a very good defense. We've cocked this up as well. I forgot when you intercept someone, it means that you're forcing them to fight you.
a professional way to end this campaign. Oh, they're breaking, take them. Chase them and take them down, and then you can follow these lot. We got it sorted in the end. trying to get in the building. So what we could do, one line infantry can come here, and one can go there. These are dead. They're being shot at from three separate places. I've just noticed that there's a general making his way inside. That should be everybody. Huzzah! You're firing at someone.
Well, apart from the savage treatment of my own artillery, that worked out quite nicely. Just got to wait for the horses to get to that artillery unit and then it's over. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, close victory because we cocked it up. Not because of their own excellence. Been a rebellion in Corland, that's good. Let's kill that first. Super duper. Right, we need to have you repaired. Demand surrender is what I tried to click on last time. And that's Poland gone. Oh, the map's done that funny thing where you can't actually see what you're doing. Right. So this should be over before the episode. If we can get inside here. Um, what have they got? They've got some troops. We don't really care about them. Uh, assault. That should be everything. Ever a thing. Of course, had I been intending. Oh, it's a little titty one. Oh, even better. Marvelous. Let's put you We can have a little hill to fire off. Had I been intending to do, to continue the campaign, I would have done it a little bit more conservatively to make sure that I could fight the war properly. But, as I'm, unless people really go ham and suggest that they want to see this campaign finished, what is that? That's artillery, is it? Oh, look. We can take out that artillery group. Oh, actually, maybe we feel like they're firing as effectively as they should be. Oh, 
What is this? Oh, it's more bloody Ulans. Catapults is still shooting in the wrong direction. Why don't you just shoot that then? We're going to take a lot of casualties doing this. Sugar, run away! Oh, we lost one. Time is six there. These are wildly inaccurate. They're not even shooting. Like some of these are going over there to the hill. We need at least two holes if we're going to do it. Destroy this button. I wonder if it don't. Isn't I? Got, for some reason, I think destroying the corner on a standard fort allows you a way into the city. I say city. It's just a fort, isn't it? Can we take the gate? Is that a thing? No, I'm afraid it's not. Let's just limber up. I'm essentially bored, so we're going to just march up and have our men do the, the work. Here we go, we can time six the movement, but... There's no way to take these forts with um, a trickery or anything like that. So what we're going to do is first let's have 
I want to see if they can be tempted to run out to us. That is the general's bodyguard. That's pretty stupid. We'll shoot him. And then we'll send P3 around the side here. death zone for them I think you might as well come around here as well friend Swedish soldiers are some of the finest in the world we do nothing if there is no orders, we stay at our posts. Very much like the British. never understand why they don't bother putting the artillery. If this was me, I'd have an artillery, two artillery pointed that way where I'm coming and one from that way in case I go around. It's just amazing what the AI doesn't think of doing sometimes. as we can upon the walls. They're pouring out now. Turkey shoot time.
you even fight anyone? Why don't you just pour down this little ramp here? Men. And then you can take that little house. Whereas you can position yourself like that. shooting at the wrong thing, you need to shoot at that. Lost the two suicide units that came charging. There we go. And that to be that campaign one you have successfully completed your campaign goals maintain these conquests until the allotted time and what what does that even mean what do you mean well I have to hold them until the end of 1799. That's stupid. Oh, well, I'm counting it as a win, and we're going to leave it open to whether you would like to see this campaign continue. Yeah, you do make a difference now. Doesn't he make a difference? So, we're going to leave it there for the episode. Oh, are we? No, I think we are. Well, do they want a piece? Now that I've got what I want off them. No. So the whole of Western Europe hates me, but they can't be helped. It can't be helped. Would you like a piece? It's... It doesn't really make a difference, does it? because we're going to end it there. So if you would like me to keep the save going, please put a comment below. If not, I will assume that I think I've agreed already to do the Dutch one. Or if you have any ideas what else you'd like to see. But I'm taking this as, unless we get a, a wide wave of comments going, um, I'm going to leave this one as it is. 
So, we are ending with the Masters of Eastern Europe, the tip of India and most of Central and Central America and the, what is, what's that? And the, what are they called? Um, the Caribbean Islands. But for now, do take care of yourselves. And we shall see you next time. Bye for now.